All right, guys. So I need you guys to recognize something about the four angels chained up up, up under the great river Euphrates. So in English, I told you guys that all this is meant to confuse you. This is Babylon, all right? And you're talking about Babylon. So when you're talking about ba Babylon, it's gonna throw you off, all right? It's gonna toss you off of the truth. You're not gonna understand it. That's what Babylon means. It means to confuse, Babel. Bible is for when you drool because of confusion, you, like a bib, you know what I mean? So it's you, it protects you from from your confusion. That's what a Bible does. All right, it's a shield. Okay, and a sword. That's what I was told, and that's how I use it. So here we go. Here's the sword and the shield, letting you know about Babel confusion. That is a weapon. That is a sword. All right. So and they're building it. You're in a world of it. All right. And they're trying to make like God and be higher than God and be God. But they, that's even confusion itself. Because his name isn't God. His name is Ahiah Shar Ahiah. His son is Yeshaya. And the Ruach Kadesh is the, is the spirit of understanding and uprighteousness. All right. So you guys need to understand this. Peiroth. See, it said, see, in Hebrew, I need you guys to recognize something. When you see a pe, a P E, that's pay. It says per off. All right. Okay, you can say peroth or payroth or pyroth. Okay, you could have a pirate. This is how they come out with his words. Look down here. You got biff rat, biff rot, bifrot, bifrost. There you go. Bifrost. Okay. Bip biprot, biprot, fayrot, fayrot, payrata, payrot, pirate, pirate. Okay, rot, rat, pay rat, pirate, okay. I don't know what, what all this is, but man, check this out. This is what I'm getting to. Where's Peru? You understand? All right. So on the other side of the world of the Euphrates, what we call the Euphrates, is Peru. Okay. Chained in Tartarus underneath the great river Euphrates. Okay. Under Tartaria. <laughs> underneath Tartarus or something like that. Under tar In Tartarus, underneath Tartaria or underneath Tartarus. Okay. Underneath the great river Euphrates. So Tartarus would be Russia area. Uh, so underneath Russia is the is the Euphrates and then you got underneath the Euphrates see the world is not as thick as you think it is all right it's very thin a very thin line to cross okay it's probably like air prince of the power of the air you probably cross over it like air and don't even know it all right air is an illusion okay air could be a ring okay air could be an environment okay you ever seen smoke in a bubble? All right, think about it. All right, you got a dome over you, so you don't know. It's a cloud of confusion you're in. All right, so like, this is Babylon. They like to put their 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 inventions above the clouds to confuse man, so they, they never touch the ground. It's, they call it the caste system over there, okay? And over here, we're the untouchables. Okay, because we don't like they don't they don't mess with us. They don't associate with us. They keep us out of out of sight, out of mind. They run the world. All right. This is what it is. All right. They've been allowed to for that short amount of space that they can rule up over them clouds. All right. Here we go. And that cloud moves. It's a dark cloud. These 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 cats, is, is, they try to be like the most high. So let me let you know, man. But everything, the most high control everything. 
because the word is the most high. So therefore they have to communicate so they can't do without the most high. So they will end up screwing themselves over anyway. All right, because he, he said that. He said he's going to use their own against them. All right, just like everybody. So that's why we're judged for every word that we say in the end. So doesn't it make sense? Okay. It makes truth. It don't make sense. It makes yashar. It makes right. It makes good. That's what it is. All right, and that's what yashar makes. Yashar can only make yashar. Okay. Okay, Yashaya can only make Yashaya. Ahaya can only make Ahaya. This is what he makes good things, all things good. Yashar, all right? Yasharal, who you call Israel. But anyway, enough of this. Let me, let, me, let me get you back on the point of this situation. Peru, okay? Assyria, Pura, Puratu, okay? Puratu. O Persian, okay. Euphratu, they took out the pu the Peru. All right. So let me let you know something, man. This world is twisted and turned topsy turvy. The devil he he twists and mitts and match. It's like a chessboard or checkerboard. The pieces are. Or mixed and ma the the board is mixed and matched all around. You know what I mean? It's not black on one side and white on one side. It's speckles all all over the place. And it's a it's a puzzle piece. The board even the board is a pe a puzzle piece. You got to get past that, okay? Because even in checkers, you can only go on certain colors, all right? So you understand? All right. <clears throat> Um, here we go. This is, this is what the devil do. All right. He, he, he's meant to confuse you guys. So let me let you know something that's very obvious. Hard to get around this truth, no matter how you argue it, because it's obvious. So when the four chain, four angels, they were chained under the great river Euphrates who you call Euphrates is Peroth. All right, Peru. Underneath Peru is what? Antarctica. I made a video about a half a year ago, maybe, saying that, yeah, uh, the great river Euphrates, underneath that, if, if you have Tartarus was was the north, was was the North Pole, then underneath the North Pole, the, the underneath not north, not south, not west, not east of the North Pole, but underneath completely the antipode, the opposite side of the North Pole would be the South Pole. That is underneath, and then you would say that is where the angels are chained. Ant Tartarus. Antarctica. Okay. Ant. Ant means the opposite. Anti. Okay. Like anti antichrist. Okay. Antarctic. Alright. So you gotta think about this. Underneath, so that's where they are, right? Underneath Tartarus and underneath the Great River Euphrates. Once the Great River Euphrates dries up. So check this out. South America been on fire for a while, right? All right. But you notice everybody in 2017 flooded up from where? Chile, Peru, Argentina. They fled. They fled all the way up to North America. They, you can see them on the map migrating. In 2020... When the when the pandemic or whatever hit pandemic over hit in China, the way that they took care of it, man, them people were. I felt bad for them people. Wow, the story's still untold. You guys will never know. You guys are gonna die before they before you find out. I'm telling you, what they did to those people in China. 
you you still have no clue and every government is not even mentioning it not even nobody's mentioning it you guys have no clue what's coming over here because those people are you see the people coming through the south border right now there's a lot of chinese people all right so where did they come from all right so you got to think about it they all went south they all went south to escape you can see them on the satellite running from china through the jungle to the south south america look let me let you know something this world is not as thick as you think it is like i said it's very thin so if they ran from here china they ran from up here they went south to india what can you do if you get south to india you can skip over all the way around here go over here and get to here and come up here there you go now you have chinese people over here in 2023 coming up through the border of texas the same way that all of the people came up from chile all right so all of the people flooded from chile in 2017 and then all of the people in china fled in 2020 down to india but there was a war border between china and india as that was going on so i don't know what the heck that was about how like i guess they got overwhelmed because when those people left it was it was millions of people ran from china because of the way something happened up there in 2020 that they're not telling you about okay I'm telling you they're not telling you we've seen the videos you guys need to go check it out all right they were running they ran from china to get they ran south to the jungle to india you could see them on the map so anyway china that's why china's trying to get down here to taiwan because they know that their people are escaping down here to come over to them it's like a whole nother like a southwest a south southeast passage because they're coming they're going from the east to the south over here and then going up over here all see they're doing the dragon run they're doing the goku <laughs> They're doing the Goku after Goku died on Dragon Ball Z. His butt had to run down the tail of the dragon all the way through the underworld in the afterlife. Through hell, literally. And then defeat everybody to get up here. It's literally the story of Goku. Okay? So, something, a lot of people died and everybody ran. Millions of people, millions just fled. They said 75 million people were missing off of the uh, the phone records all right so now let me let you know something so the four angels they said once the great river euphrates dries up the four angels will be released and, and will slay all these armies all right in the east uh, the middle east all right well yeah all right those four angels four horsemen all right now and for four bowl i think it was four angels four four bowls of judgment yeah the first four bowls of judgment were the first four angels also if i'm not mistaken so yeah like these cats they ran down here and they're up here in 2023 it took them three years to get here from over there three years i don't know if they did it by foot or what by boat or what but they here coming through the southern border all right but you got to understand something everybody in 2017 ran from down here on foot and migrated all the way up here that's why trump was like build a wall build a wall they're all on the way they're coming with their worst and such and such all right so 
he's hiding something, something else is going on. All right. I just realized how this whole Mexico or this whole Central America, if you look at it, it looks like a, a, a ram's horn that you blow. It looks like a horn that you blow right there. That's crazy. I just realized that. Anyway, so yeah, Trump. It looked like the tip of the trumpet right here, the, the, the end of the horn right here, the borders of uh, Arizona, New Mexico, and Texas, if you understand what I'm saying. All right? So, this dude was like, build a wall. Because he, this is 2017, you could mark this. This is all on, this has been something since Bush. All right? I don't know what's going on. This is this is Santa Ana. This has been since Santa Ana. All right. The Alamo. All right. So what's going on is all of a sudden you got Chinese. They they the story was is that all of these people, the story we got up here was all of these people were running from some type of fires and and cartels and gangs and government and violence some bad war was breaking out down there it was just like some type of like purge or something so people were running millions all the way they said millions were fleeing up here they were just seeing them on satellite run all the way from south america cross panama canal all the way through nicaragua guatemala new mexico or to mexico and then the same thing started happening in Haiti and then in Jamaica now. And everybody's coming through the border. They turned there saying, Haiti, you can't come. Jamaica, you can't come. They're turning them back over here. So, you know, Haiti and Jamaica trying to sneak in through Florida. But they why would they not go through Florida? Because they're closer to Florida. That's a, that's a few hours. That's a few hours to go over here, all the way over here. That's a whole nother deal. Like, yeah, they, they, they can go to the tip right here. That's a few hours. All right. And then walk over. But this is like the crossroad. That's what this is. This is like a big crossroad. Uh, to me, if you ask me, this is like some crossroad, man, for real. Because this is where the north meets the south. But, like it's a whole nother deal like everybody from over here coming up through here all of a sudden in these days all right so what i'm saying is peru where's peru peru right here Peru, right here. So the word is Peroth. Okay. A river of West Asia. All right. So look, if your ass go all the way over here to Asia, to the West, you got what they call Euphrates, right? They say underneath the Euphrates, you're going to have, you're going to end up like over here. It was like, I think it was like around here, somewhere around here, all right? But the nearest location of that is Peru. So look, let me mark out Euphrates. Let me mark it out for you. I think I'm at it somewhere around here. I'm looking for that horseshoe shape. <laughs> um, Kadith, Haditha Dam. It was like in the desert. 
And that's the thing about it. Look at all this is dried up, man. It's super dried up. So, okay, I think this is Euphrates. That's not the Euphrates. They don't even say Euphrates. All right, so Euphrates is in Turkey, around Turkey. Mesopotamia, here you go. All right, Euphrates River. So if you go so the gateway right here would have been this would have been it right here this is dried up it's all dried up all right to the persian gulf persian peros peros old persian euphrates Naferatu, huh? Paroth. Okay. Pirate, Peru, Persian pirates, Peru. Okay. So if you look up under this, because this is this is East Asia. Right here, the river right here, East Asia. Once this is cut off right here, then the four angels is coming out. They gonna meet up, the four armies. All right, the four angels. So you got underneath here, we're gonna say what, the, the Euphrates runs out right here? Where's the mouth? Yeah, I guess that's the line right there that follows it out right here. Alright, so this is the mouth of Euphrates. Uh, way down here. All right, Kuwait. I'm gonna have to look that up soon and see what that's about also. But we know that that's uh, Arabia, Arabia. So th that would be, um, Arabia would be a uh, mixture. They're mix, Arab, mix. All right, this is where everything mixes and combines that. That's what I'm saying. So you got like, underneath here let's mark it out I'm gonna say underneath there the great river Euphrates measure this out other side of the world will be right there right right about right here be 20,000 kilometers. Bam. At the point, stop it. Boom. All right. So, why is Peru right there? Huh? Peru under the great river Euphrates <laughs> under Parath is Peru okay that's the other side the other side of Parath 
Persia, Euphrates, leads into the Parath, per, the Parath leads into the Persian. Okay, you understand that? Okay, so let's go back. So, Parath means to break forth rushing a river of the east they call it in english euphrates so that's like saying oh his name is jesus it ain't jesus it's per it's it's, it's yashaya it's nowhere near jesus jesus is more to zeus but you know what euphrates sounds like hades what the hell i just hit that up that hit me right now that just hit me right now and where is that at underneath euphrates what hades this is hell pacific ocean this is a desert this is nothing for you everything is a sunken kingdom down here south pacific what do you mean south pacific the pit of Karen pit first thing it said pit Karen is the damn pit Adams town they got a little town over here in this little mess what is this the pit of Karen Island st. Paul's pool pit of Interesting. Interesting. Is this one damn... There's less people on this island. Oh, there you go. I was about to say, I'm like, what the heck? Bounty... Bounty Bay. Bounty meaning like they hunting your butt down. You ain't leave. This is a dang prison. Down rope. Somebody trying to escape. Nancy Stone. What the hell is Nancy Stone? Cause this is hell, man. This is hell. Tell me. Paradise, Paroth, Peru. All right, because you already know you're on the back of the dragon. This is the dragon. All right, a third of the. This is more than a third of the world. You, he's so deceptive. You don't even see it. It's so deceptive. This is his tops. This is just his wings, man. This is all you see is his wings. And also. You're on him over here, from here all the way over down there. This is him. From here all the way over here to that. This is him. All right. This is him. All the way down there. That's him. Go back. All the way over here. That's him. This is all him. On the other side. That's his body on the other side. This is his head. This is the scales, pretty much. This is like some scales. Because guess what? It's funny. It's funny. On the back of the dragon is his armor. And what do they call his armor? Scales. All right? So look, they rule the world by land, air, and water. Law, sea. Okay? The, the legion, legal, legion. 10,000 legion leagues Babylon okay legion that ran into the sea out of the pigs that's why you're calling policemen pigs it's, it's because there's obviously a war of words going on somebody's aware and some people are being used just like they try to tell you uh, it's a long road out of hell uh, what did he say 
some people like to be abused and some some people like to be used and some sh- like I don't know what they be talking about the Marilyn Manson songs and stuff like that. They know they're 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 mocking you to your face and have you singing it because you don't know, and that's the point. You know, you're the point. <laughs> it's souls. They're they're trying to. They're, 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 this is the scales, bro. This is the scales that they call justice. All right. <clears throat> So this is their scales on the back of the dragon. Scales of justice. All right. It's funny because it's like I'm trying to figure out this justice part because you already know it ain't Jesus. Well, it is Jesus. My bad. Justice. It's the word Jesus. All right. This is their Jesus. This is their Jesus. You understand that? This is Jesus. Jesus. This is Zeus. The dragon, Zeus. This is George. All right. Georgia, the earth that moves. Geo is earth. Okay. Orgia to move. Or to work. That's that's what it means. Earth that moves. He's blind in one eye over here. He's winking in one eye or whatever. Ever winking, he's got blasphemous uh, nostrils, names, names, nostrils, okay? Blasphemous names, Zabaraski, Traver- Traverse, Traversy, Islands, Visak- Visakoy. They call them the Traversy Islands. What the heck? I thought it was the South Sandwich Islands. Is there some islands down here we're not aware of? Traver say <coughs> Traversy. Great Travel. This is what the hell that is. This is telling you. The Candleman, Candlemas, Vindica- Vindication Islands. These are volcanoes, buddy. These are blasphemous volcanoes. They're blasphem- blast names, nostril, name, no, no, nostril, okay? Name, blasphemous names, blasphemous nostrils, okay? Blasphemous volcanoes, central, sin, Satan, central, Saunders, okay? Montague. Okay. Bristol. Okay. Cook and fuel. Southern fuel. Something else over here. Bellinghausen. Housen. Hussein. <laughs> Whatever you want to say. Alright. Ball and Hussein. Bail and Hussein. So, I'm not, I'm in the middle of something, fam. I'm doing a video. So, Belling Hassan Island. All right, fuel. Now, check this out. You got all of these names, right? So, you got George the Dragon Slayer, but you got South Georgia and Sandwich Islands. All right, they got the Red Cross for George. Supposedly St. George slayed a dragon. King George and all this mess. Alright? Rothschilds, Red Shield, Red Cross. Uh, all this, um, yeah. All that stuff. All these cats down here in the world that act like they're at war with each other run their flags in a circle like this Google logo over here. I'm doing a video. Can you guys please stop interrupting? I'm doing a video, please. Um, so, there's... 20, you see how it says like, I mean, can you see the whites right here, where, right here where it says like 2023 Google and stuff like that, trademark or copyright or whatever it says behind that, I can't really read that that well, looks like it says a, it has a D in a circle, I don't know what the heck that is, that logo is, or that copyright symbol is, whatever that is, 
but see how it's all in a circle down here it, it goes in a in a circular pattern all these copyrights that's like all of the flags from the from the world uh countries that are at war with each other up here but they're all at peace with each other down here they all run their flag in a circle no nukes none of that no nukes all right this is a non-nuclear peace treaty all right so this is what they do fam they, they run it all in a circle and they plan they planning on destroying the world with their scales of justice all right scales scallywags pirates okay these are pirates <laughs> They're, they're mining, they're landing, they're tearing up the land, lighting shit on fire, blaming it on you, saying, oh, you're breathing too much, you're, you're farting too much, you're using too much gas, you're using too much this and that. You're too much. You need to leave. All right? That's what they're saying. All right. So they're saying all flesh got to go. The only thing left, got to have scales. It's got to have some type of uh, chips or scales on it or just not human, period. All right? for some reason no man all right but for some reason it's like the knowledge of that man has with the with this of this the dragon doesn't want us to uh go to heaven with this knowledge or something i don't know i think it's gonna make them burn even more our testimony so i think that's why you want to trap us down here because everybody got to go to judgment anyway. So I don't know what he's thinking. You know, I think he's just bitter and just went, okay, well, you're going to come with me if you're going to tell him me, I guess. You know, he's like, I'm not going down alone. That's the way the pirate says. Arr. All right. So for some reason, they, they're, they're paroth, okay? So these cats are running up here. But the thing is, they're they're escaping the angels the 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 fallen angels and their nephilim and their their armies or whatever they're coming up out of here all right and they're going up here and these people they were doing that in 2012 since 2012 they they came up because we started seeing all the videos of weird possessions and weird uh, UFO aliens and stuff all over the south from here, south of Africa and south of South America. We started seeing that around 2012. We started seeing like weird southern hemisphere stuff, South Atlantic anomaly. That's where the the ozone reaches the lowest to the earth. It's this space right here in front of the dragon or it is the dragon. It's all of this area. South Atlantic anomaly is another name that they're putting right in your face. It means S-A-T-A-N, okay? That's what it means. South, S, Atlantic, A-T, anomaly, A-N. Okay, do you get it? That's what they're telling you to your face. They're telling you in science because it's sin. It, it's against the conscience. The conscience is straight up, upright, and give it to your face. Frank, let you know the understanding of it. Science is coded. It, ta it takes away and adds on and, and manipulates everything. Or else it can't be patented. It can't be copyrighted. It can't be... It's, it can't own anything. So... The only way science can exist is through slaves, through copyrights, patents, and possession. Science come to steal, kill, and destroy the conscience because everything comes through the conscience. So what is the science going to take? What is the science going to own? There you go. That, therefore, you got a whole lot of inventors that are dead, done. And it's from agents, gentles, gentiles. Agents are Gentile, a gent, a gent, a gentleman, a Gentile, agent, okay, agency, okay, these are war, angels, that's an another word for fallen angels, you're, you're a monk, they're amongst you, amongst man. and these castes, these agencies are chasing these people, 
and capturing people all down here. So this is the lake of fire, fam. This is what they call the lake of fire. All right, it, what do they say? Punta Arenas. What the hell is that? What kind of word is that? Okay, I don't know what the hell Punta Arenas means. <laughs> okay, that just sounds wrong. Okay, but this is uh, Laguna del Fuego and Tierra del Fuego. Okay, Tierra del Fuego right here. That's the land of fire. My bad, Tierra del Fuego, the land of fire province. Okay, so underneath Peru, underneath Parath, underneath Tartarus is Antarctica. And the, and the first gate that they get through coming out of this, out of hell, is the lake of fire. The lake of fire is a portal. A way in to here. They're probably getting in underneath through here. Now that I mention it. Look at the dragon skin. Look at the crocodile skin. You see the skin? You see the skin? You see the skin in the mountains? You see it? That's the dragon skin. That's the that's the reptile skin. Y'all living on top of. Alright? So it was waking up. You've been waking up. Drake. Drake Passage, they call this. Right here, this crack all across here, this gap. Drake Passage. It means dragon, huge sea serpent, or Satan. Period. That's what it means. You ain't gotta take my word for it. You can take the word for it. Okay. Drake Lake of Fire. Okay. Dragon Lake. Okay. Drake. <laughs> Okay. You know what? I just thought about it. That's funny. That's funny. Because you got Drake, but you got Akhenaten. And it's like Ake, Ak, Drak, Dracula. Akhen Akhenaten Nosferatu <laughs> that's uh, the dragon the house of the dragon so these cats they know what they're doing man they know what they're saying they know what they're naming their people what do they call old boy Vlad Pettis okay Vlad, Vlad is like blood because B is V so blood Vlad is blood so you got blood Pettis, okay. They're already. It, it's just. It's in the name. It's in the name. You can't get around it. You say in the name, but you don't understand what the name means. That's the point. The unknown unknowns. That's what you don't know. Is that the word is the most high. So when you speak the word, all things come through him, of understanding through the ruach which is the word, the salvation, the memory of the word, the meaning, the memory, the truth of the word, that's Yashaya, that's him. All right? So you got to understand, man, this, that's, this is Yashar. I'm, I'm letting you guys know. I'm letting you guys know the right way. You guys have got to understand, you're getting cooked. Just like I said, Cook Islands down there. You're getting cooked. You're getting cooked over here. You got Mount Baker over here. You're getting baked over here. And 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 this is crazy, man. Like, you're right in front of the dragon right here in Seattle. You're right in front of the dragon. Why do you think they call them the Seattle Dragons, the Seattle Krakens, the Seattle Sound, the Seattle Sonics? Huh? What do you think that's about? What do you think that is about? That's about Babylon. It's about saying the same shit without saying it. You understand? So, at the end of the day, you got to understand 
that uh pretty much you being right in front of the mouth of the dragon even even his breath all of this quaking and stuff y'all been getting from Alaska what the biggest 9.0s and stuff all the way down to to California what do you think that's doing it, it travels all the way down here to where Peru and what does it do cracks stuff open dries up land makes fire dries up his hand he's drying he's thawing himself out that's what he's doing he's thawing himself out what did he thaw? He thawed out his left hand. Right here. He thawed out his left. Right here. He's blowing underneath. This, this is all dragon activity right here. See how the land is disturbed all in a straight line on the coast? You're like, oh, it's a slow slip. Why? What is a slow slip? That means there's a vortex, a rolling... Uh, turnbuckle of fire going down here thawing out his arm 10,000 years okay 10 Satan thaw thaws in thaws hand years okay he's thawing his hand so everybody's running up here. They're running up here to his mouth. Okay, right into the mouth, out of the frying pan, out of the hand, into the fire, into the pit. This is the lake of fire. I just told you, look, if this is Tierra del Fuego, the land of fire, <laughs> okay, if this whole Pacific is the ring of fire, okay, and then you have what they call Laguna del Fuego, right here, the lake of fire over here, right? But you got to understand, where is this fire coming from? Okay? Where is it coming from? He's thawing his arm out. He's thawing it out. That's what you got Yellowstone over here for. And there's stuff coming out of his mouth. He's throwing up entities. He's throwing up beasts. He's throwing up goats. He's throwing up weird stuff. Stuff is coming out of his mouth, not just fire. There's stuff in that fire. So underneath the land, you're getting these quakes, but there's stuff coming out of the fire, out of his mouth. Death, lies, Hades, hate. You know? Because who does he consort? Look, 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 look. In, in Revelations, you got death, the Antichrist, the false prophet, Hades. Okay? But then there's the dragon, who is Satan and Leviathan. All right? And, and, he, and he's Lucifer and Baal. And Molech or whatever, all that stuff, all these different names. All right. I heard the other day some people I ain't gonna call them out because it ain't gonna help. These cats are not gonna respond. They're just gonna sit there and try to get somebody to take you off. They over here telling everybody America come from Amerigo Vespucci, bro. That's what you tell kids like Santa Claus. <laughs> That's what, you, that's what you tell kids. 
people that are, that are not supposed to, that that that, that it, let me let you know something, man. You're not even supposed to call them kids. You're not supposed to call a man's child a kid. A kid is a goat, a devil. Okay? A baby goat. A devil. A hairy, wild beast. Okay? That's what a kid is. And, and, and that's the beast. Okay? Do you understand that? So... The point is, these just kidding you, oh, just kidding, they're not, not, they're not, just kidding, but not, they're not, all right, the beast is coming, they're all over you, we're just kidding around, just kidding, that's how they get close, that's, it's just fun, you don't even understand what you're saying, fun is fool, fool is a person that don't know God. Yeah, they think they know God, but that's even the worst fool. That's the best made fool is a fool that think they know. A fool that don't know or don't believe is another is another is one type of fool, but a fool that thinks that they know is a whole is a deceived fool by by somebody that intentionally fools them by deception. That's how you can be fooled because you believed in foolishness. And that's how you, that's how, how you doing? I'm doing well. How are you feeling? Thank you. You're welcome. But yeah, you don't, want, nobody wants to be the fool. Nobody wants to be foolish. Nobody wants to be played for the fool. And that's what you are. Over here in Babylon, babbling. We're played for a fool. Like a fiddle. All right. The fiddler on the freaking roof. All right. So, these cats is playing music to fool you, hypnotize you, and to keep you dancing, keep you high, hypnotize, hypnotize minds. It don't matter where you go. It's all from here. This is the place right here. All the music, everything from the world came in right here. Boom, 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 boom. I just told you, they walked their butt all the way over here. They told you back in the day they walked across over here. All right? But if they were stopped from war from going up this way with the technology that he got today, they can move. So they, they took them three years. That ain't nothing. You think they're going to take three years to get here for nothing? Shh. Yo, they letting them in by the bus load. They over here in Chicago talking shit. They in Chicago like, oh. Oh, how could you do this to us? Send them away. Stop, stop, stop bringing them. Shit, you in the middle of hell, bro. You need to get out. What you talking about? You don't even know where to go. Because everywhere is Babylon. Everywhere is Babylon. It even speaks about it over here in Jerusalem. In the Dome of the Rock, right there. At this place right there. At that place right there, at the Dome of the Rock, it talks about you. It lets you know the rock is a map. A map of this. It's supposed to be a holy mountain and all this stuff. People worship over here. All right. But you got Utah, like Judah, okay, Jerusalem. But it's Yerushalayim. Okay, so they say Utah, yeah. Huh? You get it? Yeah. But they go you, like Jesus. They, that's what they do. All right, I don't know what this is all about. Yahudi, Utah, uh, Yada. Yada is y Judah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. This is this is all, they, they twist everything up. This is like frog talk. Like frog warts, hog warts. This is what they do, man. They like they twist stuff up and turn it around. These, this is what it is. I'm telling you, fam. So, what you gotta understand is, 
So this is a place of sacrifice. What they call Colorado. Anything with Kali or co color, Colorado, uh, Columbia, collision, collusion, all that is sacrifice. All right, something's being sacrificed when they say that. Okay, New Mexico, that's like New Mashiach, New Messiah. That's where the Rio Grande is at. You know, you, you don't got the Alamo too far away from there at San Antonio where the Rio Grande was fought over. All right. Or no, the Rio Grande goes through San Antonio. Where's the Rio Grande? Wait a second. Where's the Alamo? Yeah, Alamo right here. Rio Grande, go right through the middle. Right? Am I right? Or am I wrong? This is the Rio Grande. Oh, that's the San Antonio River. The heck? Where's the Alamo? Might be getting a little off topic. Well, if this is Alamo Heights, the Alamo can't be that far away. It should still be standing. They should have it marked out. All right, I don't see no river nowhere around here. No stream. I thought the Alamo was supposed to be on a stream from what I was told. It says almost, almost, almost park. Ah, almost. But yeah, if I'm not mistaken, it was the Rio Grande they were fighting over for the Alamo. And this would be Rio Grande right here, wouldn't it? It goes through El Paso, right? Or is this Colorado River? Rio Grande. There you go. So this is Rio Grande right here. I don't know what they're talking about with the Alamo. I forgot about what... I'm pretty sure the story was the Rio Grande went through the middle of the Alamo and they were fighting over that mess. But anyway. Or they, yeah, they might have, everything is false rivers and false lakes, so they might have irrigated a canal out of, the, out of the Rio Grande over to San Antonio. Cause this is still the Rio Grande, if I'm not mistaken. Rio Grande, yeah. Rio Grande. So if you do that, and you say the closest river, yeah, they probably irrigated that to the to San Antonio to make the San Antonio River. But anyway, and it kind of looks like something like that was happening right here. Right at that point. Elevation. It's an elevation change right here. It's a plateau. Right here. So yeah, they, they did that. There's a dam right there. There's a lake. Lakes are dammed up. These are artificial. Most most of the lakes in Texas are artificial anyway. Most everything, most of all that is artificial. All that all that is man-made. So yeah, this is a whole big project. But anyway, they're making an oasis in the middle of the desert. All right. So let me let you know something, man. Santa Ana, San Antonio, the place got his dang name on it. And then you got the people over here, Sam Houston out of Tennessee and everybody. Uh, Daniel Boone, everybody from Tennessee came over here and kicked their ass. And got their butt killed. And then nobody wanted to help out. So, you know, I guess Sam Houston later on went over here, got the message out, and then they had a last stand battle somewhere around here. But now, when was this? 
How long ago was that? Alamo. I, I probably could have just clicked on it back there. They'll probably have some type of riffraff uh, about it, but let's see. All right, here we go. Click on it. Historic Spanish Mission. This is a, a Spanish mission, a church. So you got the Tennessee people from, like I said, 10,000 years. Say 10. Say 10. There you go. Say Tennessee. There you go. All right. These cats went all the way over there into a church held up and started fighting Santana <laughs> Satan this is some crazy stuff alright the way, the way the world man the dude was General Santa Ana that's crazy like Santa satanic <laughs> I don't understand man this is a weird stuff they be saying this is a weird war I'm telling you Alamo is a historic Spanish mission and fortress fortress compound founded in the 18th century by Roman Catholic missionaries in what is now San Antonio Texas United States David Crockett James Bowie alright Texas Revolution to make Texas fighting for Texas. This is what it was. It was like we're gonna take this piece. This is us. This is manifest destiny. That's what they saying. U.S. All right, for liberty, liberated. All right, from Santa Ana. The native tribe Spanish name is. Kowahu 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 Take 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 Arms The CDC got that ass That's what happened and then the next thing after that, if you don't see the order, okay, you got to look at the order. If you look at history, history repeats itself. So when they say diseases, what happens the next thing after? Slavery. Period. That's every time. Every time. Okay, do you understand that? Oh, these cats brought over some shit. That's that they say, oh, because of our presence, these cats died. How? You mingled, you stuck your shit in them where you wasn't supposed to, and then they died. And you took their children and enslaved them. Bam, slavery. But how did they do it? How did it, how did it happen? Who who qualifies people to do that? Who said who qualifies people to, to call it what it is? Huh? It will be you got I just told you right there. They're hacking you. Hackers. Who go by hackers? World hackers order 
okay? These cats, your world will be hacked. And look at the order that it happens. A disease, a pandemic, and then slavery. And then slavery. And numerous small scale wars. What's the scale? I told you, on a scale of the dragon, justice. That's, a, that's their that's their Jesus. That little they call it a holy war. A little they, they bring in the cross on that ass. It's a double cross. <laughs> that's, that's what it really is. Fought against the Spanish. A little small scale war fought against the Spanish. The Creolio and the Apache and other indigenous groups. They saying the Apache killed him off too. All right. See, this is they're just saying, oh, they, they just killed off each other. They died by diseases and slavery. No questions asked. Said the Spanish did it. <laughs> Where is the Americans? Huh? Because when 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 did they just leave? When when? Their population declined so that they could fall into slavery. Okay, so look, America's population is falling into the, to decline because of disease, right? 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 All right. Disease. If you don't take the, the such and such, the population is going to fall into to decline because uh, there's going to be some deaths. All right? They're going to say it's disease, dis-ease, meaning you are not easy. Like, you know what easy means? Okay. When they say a girl is easy, yeah. If you're not easy, with the, with the new, with the, with the angels coming down to claim the, the women, psh, slavery and death is all you're going to get. You're going to be diseased. Oh, that's a disease. You're a disease. We gotta, we gotta quarantine that disease. We gotta fight the disease. We gotta make a war against the disease. And what do they call it? A disease? They call it a virus. And you already know where we're gonna go. What happens? You already know. Jerusalem. Here you go. Hebrew. Foundation of peace, right? This is what they're against. Like, we got our peace. They're against that. You want to know why? Because you're the virus. We're the virus. Virusalam. There you go. <laughs> it's That's what they do. They take pieces in, pieces out, to hide it, put in your face, and label your ass. Alright? Conscience. You take out the C-O-N, you just got science. So they say, yeah, yeah, that, we science. And in order for there to be science, you have to enslave the conscience because the conscience is the only thing worth enslaving. All right? So you got to say, how can the conscience be subject to science? It has to be a disease. It has to be... Uh, so either it has to be easy. All right? Easy mean yeah, you just fooled. Your ass got taken in easy. All right? Or, because somebody made a fool of you, you know what I mean. You believed them. That's what they. So you, you're 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 an advocate of theirs. You're you're an angel of theirs. You're a messenger of theirs. You're a weapon of theirs. So yeah, like you're theirs. You're you're patented now. You believe in them. It's in your mind. It's they got you. They're in. 
inside. You're not going to pull them out of your skin. You got to pull them out of your belief. So you got to put your conscience back in, your control. All right? They take the control out and they take control. They take the CON out of conscience so that it's science. Do you understand what I just said? Can you spell C O N S C conscience? Take this apart. That's what they do. And they got science. Bam. That's it. Simple. All right? So, same way they did that, they call you the virus. All they did was take the Jerusalem, which is Jerusalem, you're the virus, by taking the law, halam, halim, out. They just made it shortened. Just call you the virus. Get rid of them. Why? The same way, in the same why, happened over here. What happened? It was over the water, over the land. Take them out. What's in Jerusalem? It's a holy land. Same thing happened over there, happened over here. They die from virus. You are the virus. You got to die. How did they get Panama? Virus, disease. So all the way up into Texas, virus and disease. So all the way into 2023, the whole world, virus, disease. You guys are everywhere. We got to get you off of the face of the earth. Because the dragon is starting to look like you. They're like, no, nah, man, hold on. The dragon got to look like us. That's the way that they want to do. Because, like, we're, we're supposed to tame the land, tame the dragon. Keep it underfoot. No, they're going to bury you into the dragon, under the scales of the dragon. You're going to be adding to the armor with your bones. That's why you got catacombs. After a catacomb... Out of, out of a cat catastrophe, a Catholic catastrophe, you got freaking, what? Them Catholics went out there and did an inquisition on the whole damn world. Where you think them catacombs was built? They put all them bodies underneath and put concrete masonry over the top of them. All right? That's what it is. It's all hijacking, man. It's all counterfeit. You're built on top of something else that they destroyed, period. You fit perfectly like Jenga blocks, but it's set for destruction because it only has so much integrity. It's not the truth. It's not the truth. The truth shall stand. The lies will do exactly that at the end of the day. They will lie flat. He said, every stone, no stone will go unturned. All this is coming down. All right. So you don't really understand how far down it's coming. Let me let you know something. So if they're building, you got to understand what buildings are. All right. So what you could do, what they're doing is, it's almost like this plan. It's almost like they're shifting. You know how sand shifts? in sand dunes in the in the desert you could build a whole damn city but a, a, in the middle of the desert that desert will cover that whole city up boom and then you can go build on top of that city on top of that sand and then the desert will come and build cover that sand up and before you know it you got this mountain of sand with all of these cities hidden underneath it but what you don't configure is, all right, it's almost like the game of death is there's levels to this shit. Levels, Leviathan, levels, leverage, levitation, levels, Leviathan. What did they want to do in Babylon? Huh? Confuse. They mix it up. And they kept building higher and higher and higher. 
And he said, they're going to build all the way to the heights of heaven, past the clouds, past the most highs, past the most high, be higher than God, be like God's, all this stuff, right? Leviathans, dragon kings, serpents. All right. So the thing is, if you have... A civilization built on top of another civilization built on top of another civilization built on top of another civilization what do you call that that's a tower of babylon how much how many different languages have you built over and called it different things babbling you're confusing people oh this is getting old we're gonna change it up you've been here so long that you you just don't you can't stand the truth. Like I said, there's angels walking amongst you. And the point is, they're chasing people from where they live. Or there's people that get it. I think the, the people in the South, like the Mexicanos and the Latinos and stuff, they get it. They see this evil. Why do you think they come up with their crosses praying and shit? Because they've seen evil wickedness that they cannot explain other than from what the Bible tells them about legion, about the devil, all right, about satanic shit. So they're running up here. They've been doing it for a decade almost, if not longer, all right? And across the border, there's like a plan. There's like people come in there like where there's a disaster. There's always going to be somebody capitalizing on it. Who? Oh, these people, you can't, they got to give them disease. You run from, like I said, run from the frying pan, uh, right, run from the frying pan right into the fire. All right. Or I have a fire into the frying pan. I don't know which way it is nowadays. It's they're the same. It's just there you go. So what I'm saying is, man, it's like uh, they they got many different ways. Huh? That's funny. Six six eight eight. Satan. Historic National Register of Historic Places. 19, December 19th, 1960. Do you see that shit? So 20, the same thing, bro. What's all this, bro? What are you doing? It's, these are dates, times that they do stuff by. They do stuff on a specific way. They do stuff specifically on specific dates, specific times, and all that stuff. Because they it's, it's their patent. It's the way that they feel that they created something. To be, like I said. And, and they're creating, they're programming the people that don't know the children or the people they slaughter. They, this is how they program you, by creating a, a, false, a, a false light. They create a city on top of your people and you think that you come from somewhere else. That's crazy. That's crazy. They got you wandering. They got you wandering. You got us all wandering, actually. This is crazy. People run around and they say, oh, we know what we are. There's some people that know what they are and there's some people that don't know what they are. Some people that think they know what they are. Like I said, a fool is a person that's been fooled into believing that they think that they know better. All right? They think they know the truth. All right? Fun is, is having foolishness. That's all that is. Fun funny foolishness it's, it's, it's to to not know the truth to not know understanding to not know 
the most high. Yeah, like a fool is going to hide in deception, lies, you know, still kill and destroy. They're a fool because they don't know their own power. So fools will kill you any day. Fool, tough dudes. Because they don't know any better. They don't. So, you know what I mean? Like, you got to teach them better so that they know. That way they won't be a fool because somebody made them a fool. Nobody's, you're born in sin, but you're not born as a fool. Okay? Nobody is. I don't believe a man, if you're a man upright, born as a child, a, a son of man or a child of man, a daughter of man, either way it goes child of a believer a daughter of a believer a, man, a son of a, of a believer all right somebody has good measurement and calculations to raise you upright judgment that's what a man is all right so he's going to give good judgment and you're going to be raised good that's that's a child not a you're not going to be raised as a kid a kid is a, like i said that's some foolishness when you're talking kids, you're talking fools. When you're talking children, you're talking truth. You understand that? All right, man. Because it's foul, man. This is real foul. How is how you guys have foul is false. You know what I mean? How you call people out of their names so far removed. The same, so look, man, look, let me, let me, let me let you know like this. So when a master takes over the slave, he, he said, call me daddy, boy, something like that. You know what I mean? Who's your daddy, boy? That's, that's, the, that's the saying in the South. Who's your daddy, boy? You know what I mean? Like that's, that's just, that's, that's talking to black folks. It's talking, that's how they talk. So it's to remove you from the truth. Toby, that's what, uh, Roots. He was beating the dude on roots. Say your name is Toby. They beating the truth until you bend. So that the child is so scared. And then their parents raise them, say, you better know better. Don't 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 this is you know, don't 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 say this or don't go by that. So everybody's that, oh, don't do this, mass are gonna get you. And that's exactly what they wanted you. That's exactly what they wanted you. You are the fool that will go out and transgress on somebody who is not a fool and make them a fool. Somebody who is not afraid and you will make them afraid. Somebody who does not have disease, you will make them have disease. Let me show you something. I'm going to just show you a face. I think it was on uh, Apocalypto. The movie Apocalypto with Mel Gibson. They had the Native Americans or the Mayans or the tribes or the, the Yashara. The Yashalan people down there but right before the conquistadors came in to conquer them says it right in the name the unpeacekeepers they're about to conquer that but bringing them uh gifts or bringing them um death wrapped in in as gifts that's what they did they gave them blankets full of disease they said this will keep you safe and effective <laughs> this is totally safe and effective against the weather and it killed them okay they, they gave them blankets that were laced with bloatware <laughs> laced with freaking disease and they called them a virus after that and annihilated them and enslaved them and made them build the canal like the Chinese did with the wall same story alright so look yeah apocalypto Apocalypto run scene.
not the chasing scene, the dream, the premonition. The premonition, where the dude says, run in his sleep. Uh, Apocalypto, dream. Yep, right there. Heartless. Here you go. So, he sees death. He's never seen this shit before. Okay? So that's his dream he was having. It was a prophecy. It was letting him know that death was on the way. All right? So when he sees this person's face, he was going to know. So his father told him, he said, fear. This is the fear scene where he tells him about the dream. This is this is the pandemic. This is 2019. This is the premonition. This is what they were running from from the south. This is the angels with the crosses from the dragon coming on the boats, letting them know. And you got people running from the from the to their land crossing over we want safe passages peace and safety after peace and safety come what sudden destruction boss of god boss of god They're running up to North America. They're trying to get through. They're like, we're getting the hell up out of here, man. They're killing everybody down there. They're like, you want war? These dudes are survivors. They're meager, they're hungry, they're scrawny. And he's like, I don't know how desperate they are. The elder is like, yo, I see my people. Don't kill my people. Have patience. He sees, he, he wants to learn. He brings catch from the sea. So these guys are near the coast. Keep safe. Oh, no. All right. Passes peace and safety. Keep safe. He said, you can pass in peace, keep safe. But what happens after this? As soon as they say it, pass peace, keep safe. What happens after? This is what's happening. These are this is the the U.S. border right here. The Mexicans are like, okay, come on through, man. Like, <coughs> you guys are running from something. 
a new beginning. This is America. They're coming up to North America. South America. Yes, the dragon has come. These are the dragon. So these cats are the serpent kings moving up north now. They're like, yeah, some shit is going down. <laughs> So the father was like, yo, be still. The son is like, yeah, some shit happened. In my dream, I saw this cat. So he's gonna teach them. So this is what it is. It's, it's, they made them into fools. All right. The father, he sees that his sons have been fooled now. And that's all it takes. The power of suggestion, man. The power of suggestion. They saw their numbers. They said, man, you know what? You got the jump on us. You got more people than us. But if you're running and just trying to survive, then what the heck is really going on? You know what I mean? Fear. So you said they had the mark, okay? They had the fear in them. They had the foolishness in them. All right? That foolishness. That's what they had. They, the misunderstanding. They didn't understand it at all. So that lack of understanding is Babylon. That Babylon came to them. It separated them. They had to flee, run for the hills. Okay? Because that's what was coming. They were, those dudes were coming to build all over the top of them and their people and their bones. So these people saw the fear on those people's face running from that. And that's what is coming up here. You don't even understand it. What was the first thing he said? Infected. That was the death. It will crawl into the soul of anyone who engages it. So guess what? When you were over there, when they got you all scared out of your wits and quitting your jobs and running and, and selling off your property and going into debt, hiding all that stuff, over some stuff, putting on masks, fighting people over not doing this and that, you just, in, you, you are the virus. You are the disease because you are the fool. You've been fooled. Somebody made you a fool with foolishness. And, and it's like a wildfire of disease. It spread. And everybody is at war and nobody can walk. You're stop, you're transgressing. You're stopping people from living their life in, in truth. 
And then if they try to offer you the truth, that's when you come to take them away. You call them the virus. You call them the disease because you have disease in what you don't understand. So therefore, at this day, you gotta look at America and say all of these people running from the South up here to North America, everybody ran from China down to India, all the way across the Southern Ocean, all the way up here. They ran all the way around the Ring of Fire, did the Goku run across the dragon's back over here. Everybody coming to America, boom. And they got the Coming to America 2 movie came out also. Like that, that like just letting you know, they just putting it in the air, Prince of the Power of the Air. They put the fear in the air. It's a joke. Oh, we're just kidding. But it ain't kidding. They're telling you the truth, all right, at the end of the day. So here we go. Check this out. We're going to finish this up. So, God, we're telling the kill of us. And then my identity is to get the money. So the understanding of all this is that he was saying that literally you can't bring that fear into the village. So what is that today? That's when when they try to say, oh, uh, trust the science. You can't have somebody uh, giving you misinformation. We need to go take those people out, censor them and arrest them and charge them and then throw them in jail and lock them away because they disagree. So that creates fear right there. Fear begats more fear. Evil begat more evil. Boom. And that's what's happening. That's what you get. Sin begat more sin. You can't conquer it that way. You have to go into understanding on your own. You have to go into it on your own. It's a personal relationship. You, your mental has to fight for you. Your conscience has to fight for you. And the only way you can do that is to fight for other people's conscience. Meaning, you must hold back your fear from shedding it on other people. Meaning, you must solve your problems in order to help some other people because that's the point of solving your problems is so that it can be saved into the consciousness of the rest of man so that man is raised up right because your children will not be raised up right if you allow fear to pass through you into the rest of men trust me won't happen it's there's a karma that way that's why the sin the, the children pay for the sins of their children or the children pay for the sins of the parents and the parents pay for the sins of the children and that's the way it is because the word says so and that's how it will be in and, and that's how it always was that's how it always is and that's how it always will be so what I'm saying is that's why the father was trying to stop it right there because he didn't want that. He said, don't bring it to the village because even then your children, my seed through you won't even like you're going to cut us all off. You're going to have to go through this like this is your war now. Something that the most high gave to you, you're going to have to go through the war with. Because his father is going to be with him in, in spirit after this because, you know, that's what happens. He, he dies and gets killed. But, uh, so yeah, man, like, this is the point of, 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 a, of what this whole video is, is that they put the fear in you by calling you the virus right there, bam. And then you call everybody else. So that's like calling somebody a Jew period. What, what? Huh? There you go. That's supposed to be virus right there. Judas, Jerusalem, Jew. All right. So Judah, Judea. Huh? Virus. I don't know how the heck they getting all this. But this is what they do. This is what they labeling you. This is the label for you. This is what it is. This, it's in there. 
They say I'm not making this shit up. They got one, two, three, four. Five, six. They got like six or seven different ways of calling you a virus in Jerusalem. Alright? And like I said, what do they do to those people when they do that? What happens? What's the next thing that happens? What did it say? What's the order that it happens in? The order that it happens in is it there's a disease, and then the next thing is slavery. Okay? It's the way it is. There's a disease, and then there's slavery. The people become enslaved. Big picture. Big picture right here. That's the big picture. And then you got the microcos. You got these little, like, it happened over here to the originals. The originals. So why wouldn't it happen as a curse to the people that inherit it? their same curse if you don't inherit the land of those people the karma of it is is that it's going to come back on you the same way that you did it to them so yeah now you're the virus now you're jerusalem and now they're coming to kill you all right the u.s use jews <laughs> there you go that's that's they, that's the whole point. And people don't understand what they are. You don't understand. Like it's coded right in your face. It's codes. It's just coded, man. The way that it is, it's nonsense. It's unconscious. Okay. It's just like when they say peacekeeper, but then they put a U in. For United Nations in front of it. That means unpeacekeeping. What the f and they gonna send them in. It says peacekeeper with the big UN in front of it. That means they're not keeping peace. And they got guns and tanks to let you know. Like your eyes deceive you, and you just gonna sit there and let it roll right up on you until they take your shit. Cause what is the first thing they do? The same thing they did with the pe people in Hawaii. They said you can't go to your land, this land is ours now. We're going to decide. This is a monumental. We're going to make a monument of our success of taking this shit. It's a monument. All right? So the people are going to be fighting. And what do they do? They cut you off, quarantine you, cut off your, your communication. That's the first part of war. Cut off your resources. They cut off the water. They cut off the transportation. They cut off the, the, um, the electricity communication they cut off the food like if you didn't have your papers that showed that you had a house you couldn't get into the shelter nor could you get any help so all their shit burnt up for those people who were homeless out there you had other Hawaiians on the other islands running around the roadblocks feeding the people on boats bodies washing up on the shore off the next island with bullet holes in them What's that? Oh, they were a virus. That's what they are. They had disease. They 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 didn't they didn't open up and let them take it. So that that's a disease. They wasn't easy. That's a disease. If you're easy, they can you could just open up, like open up your legs and they take it. Bam. That's that's a easy. But if you're a disease, then you're not easy. So they, they gotta put bullet holes in your ass. They gotta shoot you. They gotta put shots in your disease ass. Alright. Your disease, you get shots, you get boosters. Cause you're not easy. You're not, you're not, you, you think you holy. You think you wanna be straight. You think you wanna be uh, one with your partner. No, you need to be broken down into pieces and spread thin and die from actual disease. <laughs> you know what I mean? Some physical disease. They take in the mental that controls the physical and they disease that so that they can disease the physical. And therefore, your health, once your health is gone, then it's manifested. It's obvious. So, like I said, this is all just a, a code. It's coded. It's right in your face. You're the virus. You're Jerusalem. You're a Jew. That's why they have it right there in the name. Virus. Virushalam. 
virus. You're the virus that they're coming to kill. You're spread out all over the earth. Boom. They need to get rid of that because you're the truth. So, you know, there comes a point where the truth is going to not rest with man anymore. He said the spirit will be gone from man. I'm going to take my spirit will not rest on man forever. So the truth ain't going to rest on man forever. So this is the point. This is the crossroad. This is the cutoff. Everybody's going to have their shit confused and chipped up. You're going to be chipped for confusion. It's Babylon. That's their kingdom. That's the confusion. That's where the spirit of truth is no longer with you. And they have many different ways from Sunday of doing it. Seven from what they hit. For it's their unholy, they, for everything holy, they'll make an unholy counterfeit. So they got seven different ways to skin a cat. That's what it was, the Lion of Judah? Yeah. They got seven ways from Sunday to do it. See, it's, it's different ways of making fun of your religion. Even Sunday is a, is a, is a mockery. So it's the, it's the whole point, man. It's just they get you to fall from one level to the next and every level is a lie every level you think that you found the truth escaping one level but you fell into another level of the dragon it's just different levels okay that's why Yashaya said I have no place to rest my head there is no truth there so if there's no place for you to rest your head no matter where you go there's a lie for you to need to solve you're a problem solver you're a light in this world that, that solves problems you, you're a coper man copes adjusts adapts solves problems believes so every level is a different problem you think money you, you solve your problem being broke but they say more money more problems so now you got another level of problems like i said you can't escape from one level you're still on the freaking leviathan you're still on the dragon all right, this earth you can't leave Babylon. No way. The only way you can leave Babylon is the word, because heaven and earth will pass away, but the word is forever. Ahaya Sharahaya, Yashaya, Ruach Kadesh. That is their trinity. They are all in Ahaya Sharahaya. Everything come through that. Period. Everything always has everything is and everything always will be so at the end of the day all this little ball earth and all that stuff flat earth all your arguments are going to be even that nonsense is gone all right so the point is they telling you the truth but it's coded and they're mocking you that you take it the wrong way you take it the wrong way. You make war with it. You got stock, live Stockholm syndrome over this stuff. You're livestock. Look, a cow. A cow. What was what did I? What, what was the word cow again? Casualty of war. There you are. You're a cow. You're cattle. Casualty is C of war. W C O W. Cows. Casualties of war. They know the truth. You don't. That's the war. All right. You got the truth in you. Then you're 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 a soft target. If you don't know it, <laughs> that's a casualty of war. Soft targets. Hard targets know the truth. That's 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 a little bit more formidable than a cow. That's more like a shepherd. That's more like a fisher, a fisher of men. That's more like a messenger of the Most High, of, of a higher. You know what I mean? Somebody that actually lays their life down for the truth. You can't be a casualty of war that way. You're a king of war that way. You die like a beast or you die like a man. A cow is a beast, a casualty of war, a C-O-W, a cow. Your cattle, stock market, they, they already bet on how you're going to die. That's why there's disaster this and disaster that, central disease controls and world health organizations and shit. Because they say you can't govern yourself because you're cattle, you're casualties of war. You're, you're literally prisoners of war.
until you're casualties of war. Your, your body parts and blood, your resources. Cows. Cows are what? Cows are for glue. Cows are for leather. Cows are for the comfort of the angels, the fallen angels. They worship the cow. They worship the, like, the beast. You know what I mean? These cats making you worship the beast. Like I said, your land, air, your water, your legal, your legion, your law. So you got your water, you got your dragon in your water. You got your land, well, you got your scales, your dragon scales, that's his wings. And you got the air. The air is obviously, he's the prince of the power of the air. The prince of the power of the air. He's got the frequency. All right? So that, that's your law. That's your land, your air, and your water. So you you worship that. You worship in the beast. Okay? The, the word is Torah. And that's that all comes, or, or the Torah comes through uh, Ahaya Shar Ahaya. So pretty much you got to be you got to know the truth man like you got to know the hebrew of it is 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 man everything else outside of man is beast if you're not speaking hebrew you're speaking beast language yes english is beast anglican angels angels beast broken angels broken wings what what, what got wings beast got wings angels got wings that's beast hybrids okay ai Artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence or what else? Animal intelligence. AI. You think it's artificial intelligence? Animal. Animal. Animal intelligence. AI. Bam. That's why the first thing that they show you is a damn robot with AI. They show you a dog. A robot dog as your AI. A robot snake as your AI. Okay? It's a, the the most purest, easiest form to, for it to mimic is a dragon, a serpent, AI, artificial intelligence. The first thing would be linear, would be a, a serpent, a dragon. Bam! Artificial intelligence. It's animal intelligence. It's that's it. So you're worshiping the beast again, period. Because what the animal do? You program the animal in by the environment that you put it in. It's like water. It's going to conform. The, least, the path of least resistance is the fastest. So therefore, you like, oh, the, this thing can calculate way faster than any man. You're just... You, yeah. you, you don't even have the whole... You don't, what, what are you calculating? You don't even have the truth to calculate. What are you talking about? You're getting deeper into foolishness and further away from the truth. That's all you're calculating when you're convincing somebody of, that you're doing that. Calculations sound like some sacrifice anyway. They sacrificing some shit right there. <laughs> oh, man. Man, this is no. Like I said, man, this whole video started on Parath. Just to let y'all know, man, Parath is what you call the Euphrates in English. Parath sounds like Peru, and the closest thing to the opposite side of of Parath, underneath the Euphrates, is Peru. Or some pits. Pit islands and shit like that. A, a bunch of underworld, lake of fire, ring of fire type of shit. Okay? So when you got stuff cracking out, breaking out, the kraken, release the kraken out of the sea, the beast out of the sea. This is from underneath the Euphrates. Alright? So when you look at the Pacific, the Pacific is... They say even the, if they even had the movie The Pacific Ring and stuff like that. What do they call it? Uh, what do they call it? The Pacific Rim or something like that, where they had the beast coming out the portal in the Pacific. 
So like when you got Godzilla and all that stuff, you got all these different counterfeits to let you know that this is what's coming. And and everybody on the, the land and the sea need to beware. This is kingdoms, rise and kingdoms fall. So we, we and, and even Transformers, what did they do? Then now they're on Beast Wars. That's your artificial intelligence. What's their final form? Now they're doing Beast. They're doing Beast, bro. So you, 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 if you ain't listening to me, just look at what, what history says. This is all they got for you. You don't know what man has. You don't know what, what is in store for man from, from the most high. Because all you got is from the beast. That's your law. You're, you're stuck. You're in fear. You're in fear. You live in fear of that. Understanding, you make law. Understanding, you're not above it. You respect it. You see where it is. And, and that's where it is. Like, that's, that's the law. Period. If it's not right, if it's not upright, if it transgresses, if it's against somebody, if it's if it's not your business, it's against the dang law. <laughs> if it's not gonna come around and affect you, it's a it's against the law. Just look at it like that. If it is gonna come around and affect you, then you gotta go back and look at it and say, hey, okay, then we gotta make laws for that. But if it's not going to come around and affect you and you go out and, and transgress on that and it affects somebody else, then you're breaking their laws. You're breaking the law. You're transgress. You're vicariously. The law is a weapon. So when it's sent out, it ain't coming back empty handed. That's what you got to understand. Look, the dragon is a weapon. When he's sent out, he ain't coming back empty handed. Look who I He's got all y'all. All in check. Look, look like a Nike check. Look at the wing. Bam. All in check. Got you all in check. All right? East, west, south, north. All in check. Okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got you all in check. So what 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 was Buster really saying? He was letting you know Ahaya got you all in check. He said, Woo ha! Got you all in check. Come on, man. He was telling you right there some Hebrew stuff right there. They making music about it. But what Nike do? Nike got your swoosh. It used to be a they we we was calling it a check Nike check, and that's a swoosh I guess swoosh the dragon swoosh. They know what they doing man. They ain't fucking with you bro. They know what they doing. They are not messing with you. Excuse my French man. They they really are getting to the point of the matter. I apologize. It's only so much. You know what I mean? This, this, I can make light of my fault only so much. Because there's, we only got so much understanding. You can't get caught up on one person's faults when you got so much in your own eye. And like I said, if it's going to affect you, it's in your eye. If it's a sore in your eye, it's an eyesore. So if you got stuff that's hurting people around you, it is a, it's an eyesore. It's in your eye. That's your eye. That's your life. So it don't matter if it don't affect you physically, but if you see it and you are aware of it, it's an eyesore. And the eyes are the windows to the soul. So now you got a sore soul. So how can you escape? There, everything is sold up. I just told you this, man. Faith only come by hearing, though. So I hope that you take that road. Not the one that you see. You can make what you see better. And this is not written in stone out here, man. Like, time, no man knows the hour and no man knows the day. So what you have is a gift. It's the present. It's yada. It's today. Yada means praise. Today. Today. Tuda means thankful. Judah comes from thankful, means thanksgiving. 
okay? Today, same thing. Thankful. Be thankful. You got today. You got the truth. You got the truth today. But you getting a lie every day that you hear. There's a lie around you. There's lies everywhere all around you. You got to hold on to the truth and spread it. You got to plant it. Or else it ain't going to grow for you. It ain't going to work for you. You got to plant the truth. That's what I'm doing. That's what you should do. That's what we should do. That's what should be done. Because if you plant the truth, Babylon can't take a foothold. You can't be confused. You have a, some sanctuary. You got some peace, some actual peace, not a false sense of peace, not a false sense of security. Like this world you look at, this whole world is a false sense of security because at any time that this dude thaws out, this he, he he's coming to make war. It's done. It's done. Like <clears throat> so, all these people on the throne up there. All these people running the world with all these different alphabet names that's all coded for this guy. And they all worship this guy. Alright? And and they tell you and label you, like I said, in order to throw you off and put you under. Alright? Period. You under. First first letter that starts with from under is you. <clears throat> Alright? That's they that's what they coming for. That's what it is. The land down under, the U.S., the penal. So if the land down under was a penal colony, and in the United States, they say we're a penal colony because most of our them, we got the most prisoners in the whole world. So what do you think? The land down under. The same way that you see it happening in Australia, same way you see it happening, is the same way it's coming. All right, the same way it's coming. It's a it's a type and a shadow, as above, so below with them. So where you think you at? I just told you, your right hand right here is right here. So as above, so below with that dude, then you're in between, right? You're in between his mouth. You're in his bite, pretty much. You're all in his burp, in his throw up. You're in the mix. You're under it. You're in the soup. What they call it a primordial soup or whatever. You're in his 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 regurgitation. So like this is Babylon. Like he will say anything other than the truth, and you're in it. And you can't get out without the truth. The truth makes you free, and that's the final word. Yashar Yashar is right Yashar is good Yashar is the truth Yashar is Is the body Of a higher Shar Ahaya Okay That's his name And his son's name is Yashaya And where the R is In Yashar You follow that out You got Yashar Ahaya It's like the Ruach Right there Ruach like Ru Ruahaya, Ruach, Yashar. So he's claiming everything. The, the Most High is claiming everything with the word. The devil is claiming everything with the flesh. So as, as far as your eyes can see, you are deceived. That's why a deceived has C in it. You can see, but you're deceived. Okay, you, you don't see. That's what deceived means. You don't see. It's a deception. It means your perception is deceived. Okay. So as far as the eye can see, they run this shit. All right. And they lying to you. Lying. All right. They got lice and Lucifer and all this stuff laced all up in you. And you have no clue. So many different ways from Sunday that they practice daily. Okay, it is it is ritual. It is the clock. It is everything is a mark is a patent is a copyright. Everything is that. And if you worship any of this mess, that is how they get in you because you're holding on to something. You can't give it up. And therefore, you're going to transgress on somebody else to keep it or take it or make it. 
or share it or hate it you know what I mean because disrespect is transgress that's hate mocking it you know what I mean and this is what we're doing we're mocking the truth by speaking this language the language is against you you're born in sin you're born in it so the, the first thing they do is start blasting off bad shit to you in your ears. So if you're getting shitted on in your ears, what do you expect to come out of your mouth? Hell. That's what's coming out of your mouth. Hell. Straight up. Yeah, that's what's that's that's our language. Sheol. Sheol. Shit. Hell, the bottom, the anus, afterlife. So you're you're prepped into the into hell. You're you don't just randomly pop up in hell. You're prepped. You are led. You're suggested, digested, suggested. Like the saliva slides you into the digestion of the dragon. He eats his own throw up pretty much. So he's yeah. It's, it's fermented just for him. Just for him. He, he, he reeks to high heaven. It stinks. Very bad. That's the dragon's lies. He lies so bad. He's got dragon rockets over your head. And they're going to come down and lay waste to the land. Waste. That's what they're saying. They're saying, oh, we got dragon rockets flying up and Satan rockets, Satan missiles that can travel inter intercontinentally, ballistically. Ugh. And how do you think they're going to get it up there? With lies. That's the only way he can get it up there. It's the only way he can get up is to lie. Hold on. Wait a second. Let me say this again. The only reason why he gets up every day is to lie. Put a F in front of that. To fly? Oh. You mean fall. You're going to fall on your head. Like a mountain. Like a star. Like a mystery. That is the only reason why the devil gets up. It's the only reason why Satan gets up. It's the only reason why the dragon wakes up. Is to lie. To deceive. So they're going to say, oh, it's your fault. Fault line. My fault? How did I create a fault in the dragon? The dragon's armor is supposed to be un, un, uh, unpierceable. The Leviathan... You, you can't, no, no man's weapon can pierce the, the armor of the Leviathan. So how is it my fault? A fault is a crack in the armor. I didn't do it. The law, the land, the air, the water, that's the Leviathan. The levy, huh? The radiation, huh? The lightning, huh? The land, the scales, the thousands, the miles, the meters, what, the empire, what is this, standard or imperial, so like, why is there two ways of doing this, standard or imperial, like, something's up, left and right hand, east and west, like I said, they twisting it up. That's Babylon. That's Babylon. You got two calendars, two clocks, two ways of measuring this. There's two different worlds. And you're and you're and it's supposed to be a one world order. The two worlds are not interchangeable. They're they are how can you say? They appease each other, but they're not interchangeable. There's an appeasing going on. 
Like, there's a little time, a cushion, a blur. Like I said, a thin line that you cross over and don't even know. And, like, you're looking at this like it's a big-ass globe. It's not. It's not. It's like you're walking on air. <laughs> like you cross right over from one side to the other and don't know it how could you they said the word says that he created the leviathan the dragon satan to be the most the serpent to be the most subtle creature ever created under heaven under shemayim okay under shemesh Do you understand this? Subtle. No man. No man. You guys don't even understand. That's how subtle he was. That's how subtle he is. That's how like, he's always been. But when he moves, it's suddenly. Like Bruce Lee. Suddenly. It's a dragon. Like Bruce Lee, suddenly it's a dragon. Do you get it? Suddenly it's a dragon. And then that's how Bruce Lee moves very suddenly. Boom, you're done. It's over. One punch, knockout, dead. He ain't barely moved, but he suddenly moved. And your ass is dead. One inch punch, knock the breath and soul out of your butt. An inch is standard. The standard punch. The basic unit of measurement is the inch, millimeter, centimeter, foots. This is standards. Imperials is yards and stuff. Centimeters and yards. So the inch is the. There's a millimeter. That's imperial. I think. And centimeter and inches. Are. A freaking. Like I said man. They got this all messed up. They, 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 they blur the lines. To where you cross over. And don't know. So how is your money. They going to take your money. And do central bank digital currency. I'm telling you. This is beast system. They got your AI. It's going, you are the casualty of war. When money changes, when kingdoms rise, kingdoms fall, the kingdom that falls, their money goes away. The face on the money is done, no more. That is time, time is money. M-O-N-E-H in Hebrew is money, a counted thing or time, literally. So that's why you say time is money in English. So therefore, when money, the thing that you counting on, your rock, your God that you trust in is getting taken away, okay? Because it's the end of that kingdom, the end of that time. You're entering into a new kingdom, a beast kingdom, a beast system. You are a casualty of war. A casualty of war is a cow, a C-O-W, okay? So a cow is a casualty of war. A stock market, a livestock, Stockholm syndrome, you are cows. You are casualties of war, a penal colony, a penal colony. You see what happened in Australia. You see what happened in America. You see how they're flooding up from the south, the lake of fire. They're flooding right on up here. They're flooding in from the north. They're flying over your head, dropping down on the north and then coming down from the north. But they're running up from the south. They're coming in on foot from the south, coming in on planes from the north and other types of ships and balloons and stuff. Weird stuff. But mostly there's an underground thing going on that you don't see. I just told you there's Babylon is cities on top of cities on top of cities. You're looking for buildings of Babylon saying, oh, there's a building. The building is the microcosm of the macrocosm. You're built on top of other cities. That is the true Babylon. The buildings are just the, the pharaohs. These are just the tips. These are just the, the nipples. These are tits up. The ground 
the ground that you're on is Babylon. That's why when you go to South America and all over America, you're on these mounds that go up for miles, for miles around. A mound, a mile. Okay. A boat, a bank. A ship, a shore. Do you see how it goes? A levy, a leviathan, a lava, a level, leverage. Okay, levels of Babylon, leviathan, levels to this shit. So you're stacked on, he's coiled, stacked up all throughout the earth, in and all throughout the earth. So the same way with his kingdom. Your cities on top of cities on top. There's, if you look, you can go from Seattle to Nashville and see in the cities that there's cities underneath the city you can walk past the grates on the street and there's like a 30 foot 40 foot drop underneath you so if the ground cracks open you're dead you're done you're going down because it's going to be rubble and buildings from up high coming down on top of that so you're going to go below below you're going under And that's the way this Babylon falls. Under. No more sound. Darkness. Like, you know, it's not like a house in a, in a tornado that falls down and then the basement is still safe and sound underneath. No. This is the shit where when the buildings of these buildings fall down, like the World Trade Center, you're like, how is it like only that much from all the, those buildings? Because there's space underground that was crushed and compacted so that's why you're seeing only a little bit stuck up there's underground city underworld all right it, it that's that's the only way it's making sense and these people are running on the surface from the south to the north because there's people underground coming up from the lake of fire i guess Tierra del Fuego, from China, India, Taiwan, all that, all them places where climate change matters. <laughs> climate change lives matter. Okay, let's just say that. <laughs> CCLM, 33LM, climate change ma lives matter. All right, because these people are running from they don't understand they're running from a damn dragon they're running from the dragon's people that it says hey you got to live this way and if you don't if you're not easy you're a disease and we got to get rid of diseases so that's the climate change your ass is going to be changing climate fast so they're predicting ahead of time that the climate's about to change so we need to adjust the next city over and the next civilization over for these new wave of uh, immigrants seeking asylum running, flooding and, and it's planned, it's funneled it's a funnel system, they funnel you right in and cap you off at the top so you can't get out That's, and then they purge your ass they purge, it's, it's, hunger game. it's hunger games after that like I said you saw the order, the order was first is it a disease and then it comes slavery and then there's these little wars, those little wars that's battle royal right there that's battle royal and when that battle royal hits, that's your Fortnite. That's your purge. That's when every man is out for himself. That's the Wild Wild West. That's the Triple Six. That's the Alamo. That's Santa Ana. That's the, that's where you're at right here. Manifest Destiny. Everybody's out for themselves right there. Bam. Atlanta Sin. All right. Atlantis. Right there. Sitting on top of the dragon. Either way you look at it. Either way you look at it, if you put America right here, North America on top of the world, to the left and to the right, to the east and to the west, is the dragon. It's on top of the dragon. All right. So America will be the one that rides on top of the dragon. All right. Babylon. The WHO of Babylon. The, the spirit of of Babylon is a is a is a promiscuous woman let's say that so the WHO 
And uh, yeah, yeah. They, they they like to hack things because they're not very strong. Well, that's what women women are the best hackers. They're not very strong, so they they like to hack things. They like to play games with your mind and stuff like that. Look at look at how did they defeat Samson? They hacked him. They used a woman. They found his weakness. They got through his firewall. They got through his strength. So. That's what you're looking at. That's what Delilah was. She was a hacker. She was a weapon. She was a sword. All right. Well, you're being hacked. Everybody's being hacked. Because you're getting hacked by the world hackers order. You can, you can call them the world hackers organization. It sounds a little closer to the actual name that they actually try to go by. But everything that they say that they do in name, they do opposite in spirit. So that's why they actually admit it that they're hackers. Okay? They say humans are hackable. They, they coined the term hackable humans. So that's the world hackers order. Whoever coined the term hackable humans, that's who you are. Okay. Because what you plan on doing to somebody else is only going to happen to you. And, and, and the Most High going to use it against you like that. Just like that. Because he said that Lucifer, the Satan, the devil, transformed himself into an angel of light. And then transformed himself into a dragon to challenge heaven. So that lets you know there's a lot of AI mixing with the flesh in the end of days to make some weird witchcraft, wizard, Merlin type of stuff happen all right sorcery <laughs> straight up so this is what this is what's coming man you got sorcerers you got storms you got uh once upon a time happening right on your butt right now right now it's once upon a time you got strange sudden all of a sudden death look man i'm gonna show you something right here this will be the last thing you see on this on this video and then i'm gonna cut it off And, and if this don't wake you up, you're in total denial. Bam. That's, uh, that's Gematria. All right. Bam. All right. So AI, these guys are playing creator. All right. Boom. Now, read, read, read this. It says, like, ADHD or, like, ADD actually says AIDS. Period. That's what it says. A and D's. AIDS. Okay? And then it says CDC. What's that say? It says SIDS. SIDS is SADS. You can say SIDS or SADS. C, D, C. Sids, sads, the way it goes, all right. And then you got, but what's sids or sads? You understand what sids or sads is? That's sudden, sudden, that's the first part, sudden infant death syndrome or sudden adult syndrome. These are terminology underneath the CDC, okay? So the the apple don't fall too far away from the tree damn okay and then you got dios zeus dios is god in in latin all right dios zeus d a d an h and an s right there dios it's death, Hades, Satan. D and H and an S. It's a death, Hades, and Satan. Bam. What, what else? You got, or you got W. Bush. You got W, them Bush boys. New World Order. And you got H. You got the hacker. You know who them hackers are. That's them Gates. Because he hired all the hackers. 
and they paying the most money to the W, you know who? Okay. And then you got the order. It ain't the order. It ain't the order. This is the organization, right? Yeah, they go by that, right? There ain't no order to their chaos. There ain't no order. Nah, there's an order, all right. They're going to they gonna call your ass out. Firewall. What, what, is it, what, what do hackers do? They break past the firewall first. Because this is what you do to viruses. The hacker makes... It's a Trojan. So it makes you turn on yourself. It makes... So you become the virus. So what happens to the virus? The virus gets firewalled, locked out, censored. Then it gets contained, locked up, put away, stolen, all right? And then it gets terminated, destroyed. So what did it just say? It said, first there was disease. What's that? That's the firewall. There's a disease, don't go over there. Disease, no, nope, can't, can't go there. It's a disease, it's not easy. You're not easy enough. That's a disease, that's a firewall. Okay, so now you're the virus. Then they come to contain you. All right. What was that? That's slavery. You got slavery after that. Bam. So now you're locked in step. You're locked. It's a, that's a lockstep right there. Bam. That's lockstep. You're in lockstep. That's war. You're a cow. Casualty of war after that. Because you, you've been labeled. It's, it's done. There's an inquisition out for you. It's a purge. All right. And then they use you to, to fool the rest of your generations. To put fear in the rest of the generations. So that they would never fight against the slavery. They would only be cows. Casualties of war. Alright? And then... You got... Like I said, they coined the term hackable humans. But do you know that order part? I think that you know who the O is. You know who O is. Who who goes by O? Who the big O in this world? That's that's that O part or the organization, whatever you want to call that part. That's that's that that's that dude. That's that dude. Yeah, that's that dude. They all in the same family. They all they all they all buddies, man. They all buddies. They paying for all this mess. Said they even coined the term hack over humans. You got the F. What's that? A F U? Yeah, you know what that mean F U. And then you got M, yeah, F M all, yeah, you know what that means, F them all, yeah. They need some help, F them all. Go send that to them. I'll give you some help, F them all. Go get them. Yeah, that's that. It's self-explanatory, F them all. F D, false prophet and death, and then you got A, Antichrist. Okay. That, that's all in your face, man. And then you got an abomination that causes desolation. Un-peacekeeper. Like, come on, bro. Come on. You could have came up with another name. You could have been... It, it, it's not even a shoulda, coulda, woulda. It's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. It's just the way it is, man. That's their scales of justice. That's their land, their water. That's their law. That's their peace and safety, fam. That's the peace and safety right there. Safe passage. He said, you come in peace and keep safe passes. You want to pass? You want to pass? Okay. You can pass. That's peace. You want peace? That's the only way you can pass. It's peace. All right? And then keepers, you got it. That's safe. Safe, go with keeping. Keeping going safe. Safe keeping. Peace and safety right there. Oh, but they're the unpeace cake. Unpeace and safety. Oh yeah, they got the safety is off. And the peace is off. All bets are the gloves are off. They doing it raw. It's war. It's it's war backwards. They doing it raw. That's what they doing. They doing it backwards. They putting it to you backwards. They just throw that little, they throw pieces in, take pieces out. Like I said, cow parts, casualties of war. It's all unpeaceful, bro. It's all unpeaceful. This is what they do. That's the last thing I'm going to show you, man. 
It's the last thing I'm gonna show you. But the last thing you'll hear, obviously, is the, is is thankfulness. To the Rabbah Ahaya Shara Ahaya Kadosh. To the Rabbah Yeshaya Kadish. To the Rabbah Ruach Kadesh. To the Rabbah. I'm thankful. You gotta be thankful every day, cause every day is a day of thankfulness. Every day, two day. Two day means thank, thankful. Tuda, thankful. Okay, Toda, Tuda. That's thankful. So if you're a human being, that's what you're being today. If you're not human, you'll never be thankful. How can a machine be thankful? You can't. It just can't. It's not. It's, you can't praise like that. You know what I mean? All right, man. You guys have a blessed day. Have a Yashar day. <laughs>